right guys, so in this video we've got a few upgrades for my armor out cost status. So we did a quick video the other day where we put a giant one fifth scale motor combo in there and some proline bad lines and it's made this thing really good fun, really fast, but it's still got a couple of problems that we need to fix. These are the stock armor ones, they look nice, they perform nice, but these shock shafts are really thin so they bend and I also always snap these bits here. So my friend Paul recommended these to me and these should fit on there perfectly. I thought I ordered four, but only two came. So I'm gonna chuck these ones on the back and then once the front ones turn up, then we'll take it out. So they fit on there perfectly, went on there super easy. Match the truck nicely, so I can't wait for the front ones to turn up. Definitely going to order a set. I think it's going to be a worthy upgrade. The reason I know that, I've just got back from taking this thing out and testing the, the rear shocks compared to the front ones. We did a big jump off the 14-foot Badlands ramp and landed on a little bit on the rear end, and the rear shocks took it perfectly, and the front stock one broke. So once they turn up, we'll fit them. But what I have just had to come... Christ, that's loud. So these are the uphill tyres from XRC. I'm actually not definite of the name. So I'm gonna chuck them on there, wait for the shocks to turn up, and then we'll take it out. I can't wait. Have a look at these wheels, guys. Absolutely loving them. Look at the size of them compared to the stock ones, look. They're quite a bit taller, quite a bit wider as well. I can't wait to run them. I think it's gonna make it handle really nice. I was gonna wait for the front shocks to turn up, but I'm gonna take it out for a run now. They still haven't turned up, partly because it's Easter, so all the postage and services aren't doing anything, and I only ordered them yesterday as well. And this will be the first run of that new power system as well. I did give it a little go, uh, partly down at Badlands and partly for the last video as well, but I really want to open this thing up in this video, see how it drives, see how it handles. I can't wait. Guys, look, already split, brand new tyre. We did take it across the field. There were quite a lot of flints in there off camera. I think that's probably what did it. So we'll have to order a new set. I haven't done a video on this yet, but it's got brushless system in there. Same system that I've got in there. Got nice big hill, could do a few jumps. See which one lasts longest. <laughs> Oh dear. <laughs> Next up, speed run. So we've got Sky RC GPS. Going to check that on there. See how fast it goes. Oh, oh! 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 It stopped. Damage your body a bit. Forty-seven. Forty-seven. Okay. So 47 mile an hour off road, I reckon that means it's got 50 on road, which I don't know, for this size car, fairly happy with. Gutted about this tyre though, and I don't think it was the tyre's fault. I'm gonna order the same set, see how we get on with it, so I'll have to keep you guys updated. They do make it handle nice though. They're nice and lightweight. They don't balloon too much, but you still get loads and loads of air control. I really like them. Anyway, this combo, this hobby ring combo, <laughs> it's just such a good upgrade. I love it so much, it gives it so much power. 
plus the 30 degree north shocks didn't get to test out the front ones in this video these took two days to turn up i ordered the front ones over easter so it's going to take a little while longer so for the way you saw me driving in this video kind of off-road light bashing use the upgrades i recommend definitely 30 degree north shocks I like having the more power. You probably could get away with just gearing up the stock power system, but I, really, I do love this extra power, it's good fun. I might go with the bash bar underneath to just strengthen up the chassis a little bit. And that's pretty much it, I think it's perfect. Next video though, I'm taking this into the BMX track. Jody's obviously got his 30 degree north. He wants to take that there, I really wanna take this there. We've got a new project coming up here, that's gonna be happening soon. I need to get back out with the speed car. We took it out, um, got really close to that 100, but had a slight crash. <laughs> <laughs> so that'll be coming up soon. Make sure you don't miss that. And also, you car, that's gonna be coming soon as well. Anyway, that's gonna be it for this video. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to give it a like and I'll see you next time.